I'm just going to show you the new mod I've been working on. Um, it's the Minecraft console mod. It basically adds this um, window to Minecraft. Um, it's in addition to the normal chat. So the normal chat is still there. It still works. Um, the text that comes up on the screen still it still comes up there. It's fine. Um, all I've done is I've added an additional one, which allows you to uh, basically more control and convenience. Um, it's especially useful in SMP, for example. So you, you've got like a history. Um, you can scroll back and forth, for example. Um, you can push the up and down buttons and you can use your mouse wheel to scroll. Um, you can look at all your history. By default, there's a 200 line history limit. Um, you can configure this to whatever you want. Um, it, by default, it stores the input and output in the console, so you can see what you've typed. So if you message someone on so like, I don't know, hello mate or something like that um, it'll you know send the message off I'm in single play at the moment so the command isn't found it's using single play commands um, what else is cool you can dynamically resize it so you can pull it in and out the window and it'll uh, scroll properly um, sorry about that it's got a close button um, which will close the window um, you can just push escape to close the window as well um, you can also configure it to close when you enter a command like the normal chat um, so like you type in a command and it closes straight away, you can configure it to do that as well. Um, you've got line scrolling as well, so you input. So I've got a big long word, hello people who are cool or something like that. Um, and I made a mistake back here, I can use the left and right arrow keys to scroll back and get rid of it. I can put in my L there, for example. And there we go, Like I can scroll like that. Um, and there we go, I've entered it, which works fine. Um, there's copying and pasting as well, so I can just push Control c to copy something and Control v to uh, paste it. So, for example, I can, uh, if I bring up a window and copy something, let's say, let's copy this, uh, allow a character string, let's just push copy, um, and we'll come in here and push Control v There we go, brings in the string we just did. Um, you can copy things as well, so let's say I want this, I push Control c um, and just push Control v to paste it, like so. Which is useful. Um, what else is there? Oh, that's right, there's line scrolling. So, uh, let's say I have a big, long input. Um, instead of scrolling off the screen like the other one does, it actually scrolls nicely. Um, nothing ever goes outside the text box. Um, and it scrolls nicely, yeah. And you can, if you go back, you made a mistake right back here, you can still use your arrow keys to go back, um, and it'll go back through history, which is quite nice. Um, you can push the delete key or backspace um, and get rid of stuff. Alright, um, what else is there? Oh, you can use the up and down arrow keys to scroll through what you have entered, um, which might you might find useful if you're going to do repeat commands. Um, Alright, that's about it for probably single player. I might show you some multiplayer um, to get you give you an idea of how it would be useful. So I'm in multiplayer now. Um, as you can see, um, there's people talking, and you know, instead of the history scro scrolling back like so, um, and never sort of uh, keeping track and having trouble, you can actually go into your console now and actually, you know, go back. You know, a few minutes if you wanted to, a few hours, um, depends how long your scroll history is, um, and look at everything. As you can see just there, that's what I was in single player, so your history doesn't actually uh, get cleared by default. Um, you can configure this if you like. Um, basically, it'll keep your history throughout your whole Minecraft session. As soon as you close Minecraft, you'll lose everything, um, but when it's open, it'll uh, stay, which is, you know, kind of good. Like if you're going between servers, you can you know keep track of everything. Um, and as you can see, there's people talking and stuff. I can say hello, um, and you see the input, and yeah, there's the output. So there's me saying hello, and you know no one will probably say hello back to me. But that's why it is on multiplayer, I guess. Um, so that's a bit like that's a bit of the console mod. Um, I hope you like the mod. Um, thanks for watching.